down there, guys. Oh, no way. Oh, my goodness. Guys, you see that? It's a beautiful day today. Windy, a little chilly, but a beautiful day on the beach. I'm back at the beach. Got the Manicore again, the, the, the Tony Eisenhower waterproof headphones, and the Extreme Scoop Titanium Sand Shredder Sand Scoop. Low tide is in about an hour and 20 minutes. And we're gonna see how it goes. It looks really good north, well, comparatively speaking. If that's just a deep quarter or what? I don't know. It's an 88. I don't know. It's awfully weird. It's an 88, 92, but it's it could be junk. I'm not gonna get too much either. down there yeah that sun or the sun the wind is freezing <laughs> uh, there's something there something not good I don't think heavy Ugh. something up here. Come on, get up on there. Boy, it's hard to get out of there. There it is, right there. <laughs> Look at that. That is not going to... Wait a minute. The shape of something? Let's see something. Come here. So big, I won't get my scoop. Come here. Ah. Definitely don't like it. Nope. But we'll put it in the, in the pouch. Ugh. First huge piece of brass. Giant shell. It's actually a nice shell. That's sort of clam shell. It's perfect. Pretty much. It's a big one. enough shells that's like a quarter yeah I think it is yeah. it might not be worth it effort to get out it's kind of like a quarter high conductor could be a penny though. I got it, whatever it is. 92? That's gonna be a silver ring. Probably. I don't know, it's in that good sand. It's a ring. Awesome, thank you, Lord. That's silver. That is an old silver ring. Look at that. It's got it's like brown. Yeah, it's silver. And the diamonds are on there. It's just still in there. They're black looking. Let's see if it's got a mark. It's got a mark right there. Something. Stir. Yep, stir. Sterling. Boy, I don't, <laughs> I don't think I found a ring. Mark stir. That is awesome. Thank you, Lord. So here's this silver ring. And it does have black diamonds in it. It's actually a really beautiful ring. I cleaned it up. Cleaned all the uh, corrosion, well, the patina off of it, I should say. And there is actually some letters inscribed on the inside. P-A-L. I'm assuming those are initials, maybe? Um, and then it says stir on the inside. So this is an old ring. Mark Sterling. Sterling silver, very nice ring. It's actually silver ring number four for the year. That's it right there, isn't it? 
Ja. It's over. It is silver. It's got a, a stone in it. It's like a heart. But the stone broke off from either a ring or a pendant or something. It's absolutely jewelry there, though, guys. It's some kind of stone. Huh. Some inclusion in it. But that's silver. Pin it up at home. Oh, yeah. Lord. This is an odd piece of jewelry. I do not know what this came off of, a pendant or a ring. It did break off of something and it is silver. The stone, I have no idea what that is. If anybody knows what that stone might be, please leave a comment below because I don't know. It's interesting right there, guys. That's a low conductor. What happened yesterday? Of course, I already dug this, it looks like. That's a really low conductor. Hmm. A 9, 10. It's iron. Oh, I see a ring. <laughs> a tiny little ring. Huh. It's not corroded. That's interesting. Another little ring. It's tiny. Ring up a 9, 10. Mm, plated uh, silver, maybe. I see a, a tarnish on it. Yeah. It's interesting. I guess it could be. I'd say, I don't know. Stuff in your ring though, thank you Lord. Well, this one came out looking kind of rough. And thought it had a chance to be silver but it's not it's just costume jewelry plated gold copper probably and it broke already right there it is ring number 17 for the year though it doesn't sound good but we'll see it's a nice low conductor it's a nice low conductor mm. Oh, why does it do that? Why does it do that? I wonder. That was a huge actually. I see something down there, guys. Oh no way! Oh my goodness! Guys, you see that? Oh my goodness, look at that thing. Holy smokes. Guys. Oh my goodness. That is crazy. Thank you, Lord. Oh, it's just got a few little diamonds in it. I thought it had huge diamonds. That's definitely gold. 14K. No, it says 12K, I think. No? Half weight. Okay, so it's... I see... 10K. 10K star and then half carat weight. That's, that's, those are real diamonds on there. But that's awesome. Thank you, Lord. Another little ring. Let's do a close-up. Guys, we're trying to block it right here. Man. Tiny little diamonds. I thought they were a one big one, two little ones at the top. It is marked 10K on the inside there. I hope you guys can hear me. I'm trying to block the mic here. 10K. It's kind of over here. Right? The diamonds I'm showing on the side. Thank you, Lord. 
Yep, it's a 10K gold ring. And this is what I saw in the scoop, which had me really excited for that stone. But then I turned it over and I saw those little stones. So that is why there was a little bit of disappointment. But it's a 10K ring, it's gold, and I'm happy to have gold all the time. It's marked 10K on the inside right there. You can see 10K if it will focus for me. Yep, right there. And then half TW, which is referring to half carat, I believe, of the stones, the uh, diamonds, they are real. So this is gold ring number three for the year. Happy to have it. Thank you, Lord. My friends, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed that short video. A lot of new content coming your way, so stay tuned to my channel. Anyway, bye now, and God bless you all.